Hey guys, this is Mr. Waltz. I'm going to show you how to do number six here, Fusion Model Creation 3. So this one looks complicated. It confuses a lot of people, but really all it is is a block. There's an angled chunk cut out of it, and then there's a hole drilled through it. So let's do it that way. We'll make the big block first. Uh, width, you got two, four, six, eight on that part, and then this little part over here is two more for ten. Your height, you got two, four, six, seven, and then your depth is four. So it's 10 by seven by four. So I'm just gonna slide in here, create sketch, click on my XY plane and create a rectangle right here. Width is gonna be 10 times 0.25. That's just 2.5 inches and hit tab and then your height is going to be seven times 2.5 that's 1.75 inches all right uh green check mark extrude it's a four square extrude that is just one inch and now we are ready to go here so uh we'll do the cut first if you look at the cut it's just a diagonal line on the top, it's three squares or 0.75 from the side. On the bottom, it's two squares or 0.5 from the side. So I'm just gonna create a sketch on the front of this. Zoom in, draw a line up here. Make sure you don't get a midpoint or an endpoint. Draw a line to there. And then I'm just gonna dimension it, D for dimension. Click that corner, that endpoint. This one is 0.75. And then on the bottom, click the end point in the quarter. And this one is 0.5. Sketch is done. Let's finish it. Go home. Extrude this half of it. You got to click on that half. We're going to cut. So we'll go this way. And what we want to do is go halfway through this thing. And so it was one inch thick. So halfway is going to be 0.5. Remember when you're doing a cut, it's a negative extrude. So I have to type minus 0.5. Hit enter. And there we go. So last thing to do now is the hole. Um, this can be a little tricky to figure out, but if you look carefully at this uh, front face here, you can see that this point right here is the center of the circle. And if you go to the left, you can see it's four squares from the left edge to the center. That's one inch, four squares from the center to the bottom edge. So it's, uh, you know, basically X equals one, Y equals one. And how big is the circle? Well, from the center to here is 0.5. That means the radius is 0.5. That means the diameter is one. So it's all ones. X equals one, Y equals one, and diameter one. So I just go back, I put a create sketch on the front. I'm gonna draw a circle in here, click, move my mouse. I want one for the diameter, enter. And then I just need my two dimensions, my width, dimension. I'm going to click on this point and click on this point. This is going to be one. Boom. And then click on the same two points, go to the side and put in one there. So now my sketch is ready. Now I'm going to finish the sketch. I'm going to go home. I'm going to extrude. I'm going to click both parts of the circle. Click backwards this way and it'll cut. And I'm going to change the extent type from distance to all so that I'm cutting the whole thing out. Um, now I just need to save it. I'm going to cl click the save button. I'm going to put number six, hit enter, and I am done.